Yo, what's going on guys? Mike the Outsider back with another video. Today we are in PS actually, and for once it is actually updated and they have added a couple new guns to the game. They have added this nice uh Olympic shotgun. Um competition shotgun I do believe. Um it's the DT eleven Pro and it's pretty good. And then they also added this new sniper because PF snipers, haha we <laughs> Uh, it has a bunch of interesting conversions, including 22 long rifle, <laughs> because why not? You need 22 long rifle, and um, it is interesting because uh, it bolts so fucking slow. It's like a TRG, but I don't know. And then, um, the only other one I'm pretty sure they had was the GSP, which is a rank 131 unlock, and the sniper is a 160, and the shotgun is a 131? 133. Okay. That was close. And the GSP is also very, uh, interesting. <laughs> and it just automatically comes with 32 Smith and Wesson. Smith and Wesson. At, they lost to... All your range. <laughs> I don't know. Bunch of new uh, conversions were added as well for certain guns, anyway, including this. A couple new sights. L let me actually put them on my AK, my, my Scar H primary. Also, if you like the music that I'm, that's in the video, uh, I'll leave the link to the artist down below. It's uh, Crypt. It's all free to use, so... Don't have to worry about copyright for once. <laughs> okay, yeah. So you have the, the this Microdot mini site. Looks, uh... I don't know. It looks interesting. Like, like a mini comp aim point. <clears throat> and now everyone wears samurai suits as well. Or, I think it's Samurai Suits. I, I could be completely fucking wrong. Who knows. <laughs> but, um... That's, yeah, they also had a new ACOG, the TA-44 ACOG. And you can't pass T with either this nor the, uh, Microdot, uh, song, uh, site. I can't think. It's too early in the morning. So, uh... My, my setup on my Scar H is interesting as well, I must say. Oh well. Ah, uh, let's see, what else? Boom, boom, boom. They have this uh, Cobra EKP site, which looks very interesting as well, I must say. I actually kind of like the way this one looks, though. But I'm still not good at PF. But at least I can still throw frags, like always. <laughs> also, ignore the fact that I have like 8,000 kills on Scar H. Huh. The fuck kind of movement was that from this rank 15? That fucking like triple crouch bullshit. <laughs> Then they also have this uh, other micro dot, the micro dot, I can't speak, called the micro dot SRS, which is a lot uh, more zoomed in. That's what I'm trying to think of. But it's still red dots, so like, people that don't like red dots, then this probably isn't the best, even though it's technically a blue dot, I think, or white, I don't know. Partially colorblind, so I really can't tell. I'm not good at the game, so like, 
Ignore that part. I was just trying to show off an update. <laughs> then we have a new Hensolt site called the uh, Hensolt Z24. And um, it looks like a fucking tube. <laughs> and it's very small. But you can press T and zoom in and it becomes a T site. Kind of like a C7... Uh, isn't that the C7 9 scope? Site, whatever. That the C7 automatically comes with. I think that's a C7 9. It's interesting sight. And, um... Yeah, I think that's all the sites that they added. And, um... Yeah, they didn't really add anything else for... Main guns other than the sights. But the shotguns get a bunch of, like... Well, the shotgun and the sniper and the uh, pistol get a bunch of their own new shit added, so, like... All the balance doesn't work out. So. Like, DT-11 for barrel has a bunch of new chokes. Actually, I think that's on every shotgun. Uh, yeah. There's new chokes for every single shotgun. So, just because... I have the most kills, I think, on... Well, it's on AA-12, but, like, it's an AA-12. You don't need to choke that much. <laughs> so, like, let's use the KS-23. Um. Don't think this has its Paradox Choke, actually. Huh. Who knows how this is gonna work. Do I even have slugs on this? Damn. I do have slugs, okay. So I can use this just as a sniper. Uh oh. They're enemies. This is, uh, interesting. What? Hello? Hit marker? Zero damage? Fuck! Oh well. <laughs> uh, fine, then. Since this only has the Paradox Choke. Which... Spreads everything out more. Uh, apparently, uh, judging by the actual description anyway of it. But, uh... I want to try it again without, like, a stupid site. You know what, I'll just go back to the Cobra site. Because they're, they're smaller sites, for the most part. But... I don't know, they're... They're kind of good, though. Am I actually liking a PF update? Oh yeah, there's also a new map that was added that I haven't played on yet called Derek, I think. But I don't know if that's going to be able to be featured in this video. Or I can just like find a random server with it in. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, this is, uh, interesting. Then, let's see. Sega 12, actually. Oh, God. <laughs> this thing with a, a, a full auto shotgun. And then just have ch a choke on it. Improved choke. Which... At least constructive choke, offering little gain but little drawback for, for pursuing them upland birds. Then that's how it works with slugs. You know what, just because they don't want you to use the slugs? I don't have slugs yet. Fuck. <laughs> Fine, I'll put fucking flush shit on this. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be ungodly. <laughs> Oh, 
Actually, what the fuck is this like? Actually, kind of good. Like the the this is actually like really fucking good, I think. I I. Yeah, this is actually, like, pretty fucking good. <laughs> uh, let's see. Duckbill choke. What is this? Oh, God. Okay, there we go. I don't know if you can actually see him. It tightens spread, but horizontally. Low velocity, tighter vertical spread, more horizontal. I don't know how choke works. And that's obvious. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know how guns work in general, though. I just... I just, I don't know. I'm not smart. What? The game, what the fuck? I literally got hit marker zero fucking damage. I love this game. This is 10 out of 10. <laughs> that was an uh, interesting game. <laughs> I'm actually gonna try and uh, going to find a new map and play it, and then we can finish out the video. All right, so I found a server with the new map called Derek. Very, very weird of a name for a map. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let's see. Modified choke. Yeah. So, oh, this looks like a updated, like, 1B rig, almost. I don't know, this looks like a really good map, actually. I think I, I might actually like this map. Of course, this is like, oh, it's this map! Yo, I remember this map, like, from, like, a year ago, it's been in test place. Also, there's more that I still have to go over, so we're not even, like... Like, no, we're, we're only about, like, halfway through. <laughs> but, like, I, I like the chokes for shotguns. That's fun. Yeah. I, I played this MF a couple times when, uh, 1v1-ing on, uh, on test place just for fun. Alright, let, let, let's real quick test out the sniper and the, uh, pistol. Oh, it's a one-and pistol. It makes sense. It's a handgun. Haha. -ha. I'm smart. Huh. Oh, they actually uh, fixed the reload animation. It actually, like, looks really cool. Okay. P pistol needs more rounds. It need needs an extended mag, please. Unless you can hit the head. But look at that, like, long bolting. Like, why? Fuck. <laughs> I like, I like the snipe. I like everything so far about the update that I've seen. Fuck. Alright. Alright, so then if we go over to... I'm just gonna go back here because why not. New melees have been added. Uh, let's see. The Tonto, which is a rank zero. You just have it automatically now. So, uh, let, let's go and run around with... The, ooh! Kind of like, uh... Kind of like Michael Myers slasher, like. And then this one is just like very interesting. 
bestseller author, comedian, actress, and producer, Phoebe Robinson, is back with Please Don't Sit on My Bed with Your Outside Clothes, her most read book yet. Tap to learn more. Come here. Ah. The Phoenix Doctor of Physical Therapy program at Tufts University. You better actually try and melee me. There we go. Fuck you for not meleeing. Melee fight me, you bitch. Offered by Tufts University. It features collaborative online courses accessible from anywhere. Anyways. Uh, then we got the comma, which is like. Uh. Yeah, it's an Asian farming tool, as the description says. It. Like a mini, uh, Reaper thing. Aw, oh, fuck you. Yeah, I, I like, I like those. Those are the only two that were added that, you know, you, you can't. Oh, this is rank 60 unlocked. Interesting. Ah, the, the event melee. Flame of Olympia. Is there any other new melees? Ah, the Uchiwa. What the fuck kind of weird ass shit? Warfare ranges and like great for bonking the heads of your enemy soldiers who use this often feel need to scream Japanese. Ah! <laughs> this. Interesting melee. It looks like a, uh. I don't know anymore. It's... I don't know. I, I don't know how to feel about this. Dead. That's how I can feel about it. And then you got the Starless Fun Post. What the fuck? <laughs> what is the Star versus the Forces? Oh god, and it has a fucking rainbow when you go to fucking slap. I wish people would actually, like, you know, use melees and not just be like, Nah, you're using melee, I'm gonna gun you down anyway. And then you have the Cursed Shanae. Shanae? Has very interesting, uh,. Uh, effect when moving around. Ooh. Run, running animation is very, uh... So this is the right click. Mm, it's interesting. I love the fucking particle effects on it. And then the left click is also pretty nice as well. Hello enemies, I would like to, um, talk, uh, about, um, anime. <laughs> yeah, that, that's what we're gonna talk about. Tell them totally not how I'm just gonna, like, bludgeon them, then bludgeon them to death with nothing. Fucking hell. And then we also got new cases. They're two, tier two. Should be. Uh, nope. Okay. They changed it then. So we have the rainbow case. I'll just buy... I'll, I'll just buy two of these. Just so you can see a couple... These are all the skins. There, there's actually like quite a lot, and I like the look on most of them. So yeah, that that kind of expensive, but like, oh well. And then there's also a Pacific case. These actually look like really nice as well. Like, it's like a new form of the. I don't know, they, they had, they added a very Asian twist with this. Like, I, like, very Pacific Island nation. Like, feel with, like, 
this ooh, and we got very rare as well. Hell yeah. So yeah. Gonna gonna be checking all these out before we uh leave. Then we have the SEL. I'll I'll just buy one because like not very many skins you, you can get out of the SEL case. At least not right now. Maybe there'll be more in the future. Don't know who that is, because I don't know fucking special clan members. <laughs> then we have a to to topo topograph case. Instead of topography, it's a topograph. Yep. I'll buy two of these as well. Jeez. Hopefully this has been an interesting video for you guys. And um, I, I was like a Glock 17 and Glock 18 kids. That's good anyway. And then yeah. That's all of them. So now we can actually like look at the skins on guns. So let's first look at the MP40 skin. Called Dragon's Den. Very uh, ornate design on it. And I think I just ruined it by putting blue on it. Yeah. That actually looks like really nice. Oh! And then if you change that from white, then it also changes. How the, uh, everything else looks. Interesting. I didn't know if that would or not. So, uh, that's actually, like, really cool. Yeah, I mean, I'm not the best at making skins, so like, that's whatever. And then, let's see, where's... I have way too many skins, I swear. <laughs> let's see, did it do do boom? All of them were like... And then this is the one of the ones from the rainbow case. It's interesting. It's interesting, definitely. Or pride case. I I forget which one. And then this is from the Pacific case called Carping Crazy. Very nice. Very very nice looking skin. For even for a common, like. And then MSG skin called Intergrade. Very, uh, I don't know. Interesting. Different. I don't know what else to say about it. Doesn't look bad nor good. Just exists. My opinion. Then there's a Glock 17 and 18 skin that I got. Writer skin that I got for Glock 17 and 18. Kind of wish it was like customizable, but looks nice though. And then P90 from the SEL case. Looks interesting. Puts a fucking anime girl on your fucking gun. Alright. Is that an anime girl? I don't fucking know anymore. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, hit that <laughs> hit that like button, uh, hit that notification bell to get notified when I upload, and subscribe if you are new. And again, the artist um, music uh, YouTube channel will be linked, and I'll also link their Spotify if you enjoyed the music that was in this video. And um, yeah, new PF update called uh
Pacific Cold Front Part 1. And also, I, I'm, I should say this before I end the video, that the, uh, the Olympic Torch, wherever it is, this, is only available for a limited time. It's only available until Part 1 is done, which I don't know when that will be. But just putting it out there that this is not going to last forever. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, again, this is Mike the Outsider, same piece. Have a great rest of your day, and, uh, hope you enjoyed the video. See ya!